Hey folks, this is Deco Harrington. Welcome back to XCOM 2 Legend. So today we're going to be running Operation Bear Stairs. This is our next alien facility mission to push the counter back by a couple days. We're going to be taking along Abby, Madeline, Mox, Tom, Amanda, and Vlad. After much waffling. So this is very difficult. It looks like it's very difficult because there's a sectopod on it. And also our next alien ruler. I'm assuming that they're coming in order, so that should be the Berserker. Which is... Which is fine. I guess that's alright. Um, I do have the Serpent Suit in the production queue. I hadn't realized that it doesn't take any supplies, so... Oops. So, we're getting that loaded up. So... I don't quite have the dream team I want, because... I am taking Vlad on a very difficult mission. And I'm not pleased with him, because he does not have the ability to take extra ammo, and that makes him objectively worse. What I did is I did give him Shrapnel, so now his Claymore does a little, little extra damage, like plus three. So, hopefully we can take advantage of that to get some laws in here. Man is coming along basically as you'd expect. Tom's coming in to come shoot things. Mox, so on and so forth. So Mox is taking the EMP grenade for the Sectopod as well as AP because he can throw a grenade and then shoot. And or shoot twice. So that should be fun. He's also got a repeater on his gun now instead of the uh, expanded mag. So hopefully that works out okay. I waffled for quite a long time over whether or not to take the Skulljack or another grenade on Abby and decided to go with Abby. You may notice I don't have many exosuits. That's because the Warden armor is objectively better. Unfortunately, that also means that I'm down some explosives, so... Actually, I'm second-guessing that decision right now. Explosives are pretty good. Well... Nah, this will be fine. Okay, so I think this will be okay, so... Hopefully we get some nice controlled attacks. I wouldn't take Vlad, I would take the Spark instead, except that we're also going to have the Ruler, so I need to make sure that we get some very nice approaches, so... Yeah, let's just go ahead and do it. Should be fun. These have always gone smoothly and easy, and everything's been fine. Local resistance forces tipped us to the location of an alien facility tied to the Avatar project operating out of this area. We're going in to shut it down permanently. Approach the target and place the X4 charges at the designated position. Then move to a safe distance for detonation. If we can take out that facility, we might just buy ourselves some time. Seeing what our explosives do, my idea of a safe distance is typically the next time zone. Oh, I didn't finish my reasoning for the Skulljack. I wouldn't mind uh, stabbing a Codex today, except that, with the ruler around, I don't know, I just don't want things to get out of hand. That is going to be happening pretty quickly here, though, because I don't mind Codexes. They're not a big deal. And then Tynan will stop whining at me all the time. All right, so what have we got? So we're in high ground. That's nice. Um, we're quite a ways back. That's fine. I do want to have some room to approach. What are we looking at side to side here? In kind of a kind of a weird corner spot here, aren't we? All right. Well, let's go take a look. There's no chrysalid, so should be safe to kind of sneak around. After last mission, I'm rather enjoying not having chrysalids. Let's poke our head over the top here. What does this look like down there? Okay, that looks pretty clean. So. Yeah, let's just go ahead and let's just move up here all the way. Um, just trying to think if there's any particular place I want to put someone, and there's not. Oh, you are Amanda. Okay, I was like, where's Amanda? I found her. It's too bad that extras don't show up on these missions. Wouldn't that be fun? The answer is yes, it would be. I feel like the advent showed up in our last campaign on missions like this. Maybe not. I do notice they've taken out the stompy robot sectopod noise, which is great. As you order, Commander. Yeah, it was nice to have some warning ahead of time, but oh man, stompy robot. That got old. I took the rifle that doesn't have any mods on it. Awesome. Just awesome. So he's even more worthless than usual. Alright. Great. Alright, well it's clear to move up kind of a long way, so let's go ahead and do that. How far over can we get? Mox should be able... What's up with Mox? Why is he so slow? That's weird. I heard that. So maybe Stompy Robot's not that far away after all. Hmm. That means I want to make sure that everyone is LOS off to the side. More or less. Alright. 
Yeah, I hear you. All right. So, Vlad, where are you lurking? There you are. Um, I don't want to reveal him. I wish it wouldn't do that. That scares me. I don't want to reveal him at the moment, obviously. So let's put him someplace he's not going to get flanked. Something over here-ish should be fine. I don't plan on using any extra explosives with this pod. We shouldn't need it. Okay, good. And how should we set up up here? Okay, you can go up to there. I am going to have to bring Tom out, and I'm not happy about that. I would rather keep him concealed, but that is apparently not to be so. Oh, I can't, can't actually do what I want. I want to be able to get two shots with Mox. These guys may move close enough that I can get at them with Tom. Or I can move Tom over and wait a turn. That might be a better idea. Because then I can move people where I want them. On the move. I want Madeline back here. And I want Amanda up here. And I want Tom over here. That's what I want. Okay, we'll wait a turn. Everyone's gonna get exhausted from this mission anyway, so it's like... No point in rushing. Ah, crap. That's not what I wanted you guys to do. Should still be okay. Can I see with anybody useful? Not Amanda. I mean, I don't mean to imply that Amanda's not useful. She's just not the one I want to open. Yeah, let's just... Let's just go ahead and get this party started. Because we're not going to be moving up, thanks to that sector pod. Alright, good hit. It's all good, though. Come here, guys. Alright, good. That's about what I wanted you to do. So now, Tom... Oh, I'm sorry, Ben. Ben can see nobody. Damn it, Ben. Oh, I suppose he does a full cover next to him, doesn't he? Uh, yeah. All right. Um. Whatever you say. Come on over here. Yeah, these are not great shots. 76. Feel free to hit this, please. Nice. Very good hit. 7 damage, so he's probably dead. And, let's see here. Madeline, can you see anyone from back here? You can. Why don't you go ahead and take this 93? Nice. Very good. Alright, we got these guys in the back. No problem. Nope, they are not. Mox, go ahead and get your first shot in here. Really? Oh, okay. I can say that's not what I was expecting out of you, to be perfectly honest. Can we get a pistol kill with Amanda? Probably. Yeah, yeah, we can, for sure. Good hit. And... One more time. What? No. Little bugger. Alright, you have the thing where you shoot them and it won't bring you out of stealth, right? Ooh, but you gotta kill it. Can you get high ground on this thing? Scarily, yes. I honestly expected him to... Oh, do you not really have that? Hold on a second here. Yeah, no you don't. You just gotta hit it. Better not miss. Okay, good. Alright. Well, that was okay. And here's the Berserker. Crap. I really, really wish that I had some overwatches for this. Hmm. Hmm. Now, freezing it only stops it for one action. I wish I brought an acid bomb or something fun like that, but I did not. Hmm. Oh, I wish you had Salvo. Just seems like a waste to use a Frostbound on just this guy. We're going to take a bunch of stun damage, unfortunately. But if you shoot him, you get some shredding in. 
versus freeze that stops him for only one more person. Ugh, I don't know. I hate this one. Well, let's take the shot. Hope this is the right choice. I don't think you can get at to us next run. I don't know if I can move. If it can, I could be in trouble. And it can. Oh no, it can't. Okay. Oh no, I was gonna axe it. Crap. Um, okay. Can anybody see it? Amanda can. That's not what I was hoping would happen. Okay. Well, this is pretty crappy. Grenade it? No, that's not a good use of her turn. Um, crap. I'd really expected that thing to stay visible somehow. At least we get some good damage on it from her. The joys of extra moves. Okay, that one sucked. Uh. Really? No. Uh oh. Huh. I had forgotten its range was quite that big. All right. Um. Son of a bitch. Okay. And Mox can't, like, see it at all. This is not going great. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, and you're revealed. This is not great. Huh. seen what happens when your entire team gets stunned. So this should be interesting. Yeah, you missed. Hmm. Now what? Alright, well, welcome back to not being stunned anymore. Right. Yeah, I'm not loving this. We've had better days, and it's just going to immediately stun us again. This one is a huge pain. Don't let that thing escape. Oh, are you leaving? To open rift. Well, not much I can do about it. Well, this was a mess. Huh. Alright, well, how much damage did we take? No, 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 not now. Okay. Just an officer and a trooper. Okay, we can handle that. Never mind. Hmm. Alright. We got this. Alright. Welcome back, everyone. So. Yeah. So, Abby... I think I can only wake up one of these guys, right? Yeah. Or can I come back and like hit the button and wake them up? I don't know. Well, shit. Just shit. <laughs> oh, this is not great. This is not quite what I was hoping would happen. Okay, so who are we going to worry about? They both have grenades. I really need to kill both of them. That's not going to happen. So in that case, um, I guess Mox at the moment. Let's get Mox up. Hey, Mox. Need you to give me a hand here, buddy. Alright. So now, 
Who should we focus on? Let's start with the officer. He's got more health, yes, but... That mark is just mean. I hate it. Okay, can we get some good shots on him? Ooh, justice. Uh, yeah, I would like to get that off cooldown. Come here. Even a stun would be nice. Oh, well, shoot, I wish I'd used that first. Mm, okay. 59%, that's not great. I think, I can't remember if I can use demolition after I move or not. Yes, I can. So if I do that, what do I have for finishing moves here? So we'll have a pistol shot. We'll have two pistol shots. And a rifle shot, potentially. A rifle shot from outside of cover, but a rifle shot nonetheless. Oh, and a shot for Mox. Yeah, 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 this is fine. Okay, good job. Okay. And Mox. 79 is still not great. Take it, though. Good hit. Yeah, you're fine. And... Um, we can pistol this guy, right? 97. Yeah, sure. Okay, good job. There you go. And I want Vlad to kill this one. Good job. Get some kills on both you guys. Pistol Overwatch. Alright, well this has been super weird so far. So now... Not totally sure what to do with him. I just have to, like, carry him with us, don't I? Yep. Oh, man. This is gonna be a problem. Well, actually, no, let's not use Shadow yet. Okay. Well. Crap. And Mox still has a free reload, so that's good. Right? Reload free, yep. Alright. And because we evac on this mission, I have to carry him with us the whole time. This is rough now, missing two team members. Not insurmountable, but I'm not happy about it. Turret, yeah, that's fine. Amanda, you busy? Thanks. That armor's tough. Yeah, but you're tougher. Is that the right response? Something like that. Okay, so should we take him along with us, like, the whole time? Should I come back and get him? I'm uncomfortable leaving him way back behind us. So let's bring you along with us as we move. I don't love it, but... Oh, I was going to get heal on Mox, and I forgot. That's okay, though. I think if I drop him, that uses up my turn. Yeah, that's okay, though. I do want to use that heal. Man, unconscious is a pain. Wish we had more revival protocols available to us. But we don't, so... Stop complaining. Okay, let's shift up a little bit here. Don't you have the permanent mark? You do. Just can't see it from a lot of places. Okay. Whatever. Probably should have just left him where he was. Alright, let's get rid of this turret. Thank you. Nice hit. Yep. Hey, promotion! Phenomenal. Okay, so there's one thing going on well, this particular mission. Alright, Abby, let's get a couple heals in quick. Um, I think I'm most concerned about Mox. Everyone else is only missing a couple. Vlad's missing four, yes, but it's not that bad. Okay, we shouldn't get anything coming in to step on us for Overwatch. So let's get ready to carry our poor unconscious buddy with us. His hair, still amazing. Just saying. Alright. 
At least with Vlad, we'll get some warning before anything pulls on us. I really wish I knew where that stupid sectopod was. It's a little tempting to just zoom in and blow the whole thing up and leave. Well, we can just keep killing turrets. Oh, you can't see it? Really? Can you not lean over that direction? Is it because of Mox? I think it's Mox. Can you see it now? No, that's weird. Huh. What would be blocking it? It says we can see it, but that's obviously a lie. Is it because it's a ways back? Hmm. Yeah, yeah, I know you're back there. Seriously, stop it. It must be because it's kind of a long ways back. Or, it's because I'm dumb. I will reposition. Yep. Ah. Alright, back in cover you go. Don't you get snippy with me. And we'll take a boring turn or two here to get rid of that turret. Because I have better things to do with my life than deal with turrets. Ooh, that's not a great shot. 26% squad sight. Ah. Enemy is still up. Yeah, it is. Alright, Amanda, I know it's a long ways away. I need you to hit this anyway, please, okay? Just, I need this thing gone. Thank you. That's funny how missing it didn't activate it. I like that. So I, was, I could sneak up and look around a little, but if I do, I have to make sure I keep line of sight on the turret. And I can't, so... We all just stay where we are. Alright, we'll blow it up this turn, and then I can move up and figure out where the sectopod is. We may do this quick fast, where we head on in and plant it with our stealthed reaper, and then just, like, leave. We've done that a couple times. That's not where I meant to click, but it's okay. Oh, okay. I honestly expected something bad to be back there. Okay... Well, in that case, we shouldn't need Overwatch. God, I hate the stomp bot sounds once they start making it. It's like... Ugh, it's just scary. Yeah, we're not going to get any Overwatch at all with Abby. This, like, entire mission. So, it could be worse. And you just stand there. So, given that we don't see it in here, let's come take a look around. It may be behind the building. Let's see what it looks like inside here. Yep, there's our objective. Yeah. Let's duck just around here. That should still be perfectly safe. Just want to make sure I'm not going to see anything through the walls. Okay, well that's interesting. Well... What we'd want to do then is come over here and stay there, and then he'd have two moves to escape on the next turn. And if we do that, we actually don't really have to move up much in order to leave on the next turn. So let's consider doing that, because why not? Right? Right. We have taken kind of a beating so far on this mission. Let's everyone hide around this tree. This tree will protect us. I have faith in the tree. Alright. Yeah, there's two pods left, so... Oh no! It's the purifier, okay. Oh no, it's a priest. Crap, I hate priests. Wow! And a lancer. That's nice, and the priest just bubbled, right? Nope, not quite. Okay, we can handle a priest and a lancer. Surely. Right? Okay, what do your lightning hands look like? Not awesome, to be honest. 
Okay, we gotta put Ben down here for a minute. You'll be fine, bud. Just don't go anywhere. Alright? Okay, so... We can't quite grenade this guy. Oh, that's frustrating. So in that case... We do have justice available to us, but only for one of you, and it sucks. Do you still have a free reload? Where's reload? Free reload. Okay, good. Well, I think we're going to have to use some explosives here. And that's fine. I mean, I don't mind. I just can't hit them both, and that's kind of annoying. Actually, I can take out the Stun Lancer's cover. Actually, can I hit the Priest? No, I can't. Err, that's too bad. Yeah, and this is the biggest radius I can get, right? So, I can get the Priest to bubble and take out the Stun Lancer's cover. That's alright. Sorry, I'm just going to, like, pixel hunt here just to make sure that I can't do that thing that I want to do. It's because they're on different levels, otherwise I'd be able to reach them. Okay, well, let's bubble up the Priest and get the Lancer ready. We're probably not going to be able to overwatch him. Oh, it just killed him outright. Well, hot damn. Isn't that great? Good hit. Nicely done. If by hit the arrow you mean, like, nearly exterminated, then yes, it did. Let's play it a little tiny bit cool. I don't want to move up any further. Not in that direction. I will just stand out of cover. What's the worst that could happen, right? 62, that's the worst that could happen. Alright, perfect. Okay, now let's do the scary thing. Uh, please don't reveal, please don't reveal. <gasps> they are right there. Okay, this is fine though. Okay, let's not forget Ben. Come here, buddy. Okay, we can get to there. And you can get back to here. And you can get to here. And you can get to here. Okay. Let's, uh, live a little crazy here. Beep. Bleep bloop. Yep. Hello. Yep. And that is why we are leaving. So, um, we can put this kind of anywhere, actually. If we put it here, let's just make sure Vlad can get out. It would be rude of us to leave him behind, and he can't. See, and that is why you check these things. Can we all get up there? If not, we're in trouble. <laughs> okay, we can. So, it's got to be on one of the other sides of this thing right here. So, here would be fine, or there. Oh, I can do this over quite a ways. Let's put it here. Alright, then let's get out of here. Yep. So long, suckers. Don't mind that bomb I just left. Everything's fine. I wouldn't worry about that one. Okay. And Abby, since you are carrying our teammate, why don't you head on over? And Mox. They're like, hey, where are you guys leaving? I'll tell you why, but if you wait about two minutes, you'll find out all by yourself. Alright, well, good enough. Didn't get any loot. Got a lot of injuries. Did get a promotion. Good enough. Stupid berserker. God. 8 out of 13. Nah. <laughs> 6 injuries. Ouch. All right, let's see what the damage is. It shouldn't be that bad. Woof. That's... That's gross. All right. Steady hands or aim? Let's see here. I think I went with aim, but it doesn't matter at the moment because everyone's injured, so that's fine. Reduce progress by two, that's fine. I do have an engineer in here. 
back. Our armory is going to look grim here. Ugh. Uh, we can feel the team. That's fine. Okay, well, let's see what's next on the agenda. Ta-da! Alright. Uh, we're actually out of Illyrium, too. And unfortunately, we don't... Oh. Hey, they're back! <gasps> Let's go find them. It's annoying I have to rescan for them, but that's okay. We desperately need them back. That's fine. I don't mind at all. Well, I kind of mind. But not that much. Yay! Alright. Well, we need data pads and alloys. Officer corpses. Okay, we don't need most of you guys. We can sell a couple of you. Trooper corpses. Actually, nothing at all now. Let's keep... Four, just in case I decide to build another exosuit, but I can't imagine why. Um, we may make more mine shields. I'm going to hold on to those. Stun lancers. Spider suit. We are not going to be making any more of those, but that's okay. Um, we can sell one of those. Alright. What else can we sell? Obviously, we're not going to sell our sectopod. Oh, we don't need purifiers for anything. Very good. We haven't done Andromedons or Chrysalids yet. But we could spare a couple of Chrysalids. Oh, we can spare a bunch of Spectres. And we'll have to hold on to the Archons. I don't know how many I need yet. Anything else I want to sell? I don't think so. So that's not a lot of money, but whatever. And what can we get? Let's see here. Oh, Warlock information. Uh... We don't need that. We have supplies. Superior perception. I th think that that one... I think that's aim. Illyrium? Uh, yeah, we need it. 50 intel. Ugh. Here, hold on a second. Before we get carried away, let's go look and see what it is I want to buy. Okay, so... Just give the word and I'll get started, Commander. So what we want... It would be nice to upgrade the spark. That's really expensive. He's going to wait for a little bit. So we're going to need gauntlets soon. That's hellishly expensive. I'd like the bullpup, which is hellishly expensive. Mm, okay, so let's get the Illyrium. And then we'll kind of go from there. I like Illyrium. Welcome back, guys. Come on. Lyrium's great. You can never have too many Lyriums. And I think we'll wait for just the moment and everything else. Okay, so now we've got assorted loot and supplies. Let's go get extra supplies. Blah, 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 blah. So I guess the question here is, when do we want to go after... Stabby lady. Or we could do her second, and we could do the hunter first. The thing is, is we don't come across him very often in the field. And we see her all the time. So, who would I take? I would be taking Ramos and Penny. And Mox. we got to wait three days. Okay. And then probably Abby and Elena. So we need a couple days anyway, so that's fine. Alright, we'll just scan for supplies. We'll let the serpent suit come back. Oh, new targets, never mind. All right, what do we got here? Rescue an item to, ooh, alien cipher. That's an unpleasant one. Advent troopers under all advent. Okay, that's interesting. And we've got sabotage transmitter for an engineer. Oh God, I don't want an engineer. Or new construction for Intel. Hmm. All right, I'll have to think about this. When we come back, we will pick a gorilla up and then go cause a ruckus. So as always, thanks for watching and I will see you next time.